गुड मॉर्निंग डी स्टूडेंट वी हैव ऑलरेडी कंप्लीटेड फोर चैप्टर फर्स्ट रिप्रोडक्शन एंड ऑर्गेनिज्म सेकेंड सेक्सुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इन फ्लॉरिंग प्लांट्स थर्ड रिप्रोडक्शन इन ह्यूमन बींग एंड फोर्थ रिप्रोडक्टिव हेल्थ इन डिफरेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ दैट chapters we have already discussed at my youtube channel hr portal ya tutorial unit first is completed now we have start from today itself unit second that is the genetics and evolution and genetic and evolution that unit have the maximum marks of cbsc paper of class 12th maximum weightage and only three chapters are there chapter number 1 inheritance and variation mendelisms second molecular inheritance and third that is the evolution here is the one marks question two marks question three marks question and five marks question all type of varieties of questions are available in cbsc exam not only in cbsc exam when you have go through the competitive exams whatever type of exams that may be basic as exam competition exam that may be neat or whatever type of other exams where general science is there there that topics is 100% are there so first of all we have discussed about the particular terms inheritance dear friends here is the one thing is here in case of that part the first of all some concepts are there in case of that part first inheritance as well as that is also known as the heredity second there is the word is the variation term is there third the term of genetics what is the genetics and what particular criteria should be used so in that case and later on mendelism mendel is the father of genetics father of genetics so first of all inheritance as well as heredity what is the inheritance the trait or the character are transfer from one generation to another generation for example the trichomes on ear the hair on ear of the pinna part that can be transferred from one generation to another generation that is the heredity or that is the inheritance also yani one generation to आदर जनरेशन में करेक्टर्स के ट्रांसफर होने का प्रोसेस हेरिटेजी कहलाता है इनहेरिटेंस कहलाता है आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस दैट पार्ट वन मोर एग्जांपल फॉर एग्जांपल समटाइम्स द हाइट ऑफ पर्टिकुलर पर्सन और द इंडिविजुअल वी हैव जस्ट डिस्कस व्हाट कैन आई डू आवर पेरेंट्स हैव नॉट इन मोर हाइट that's why my height is related with parents i mean that is again the concept is related with heredity heredity means the characters are transferred from one generation to another generation that is the heredity case number 2 that is the variation variation means the particular person which is different from parents For example, yourself, myself is 
not similar with parents. I have the different from parents. Maybe some traits are similar, but some traits are definitely different. That is the variation. Again, the question is there. Why the variation is there? Then your answer. Due to the sexual reproduction, the crossing over is there. Gametogenesis process is there. And due to the gametogenesis process, there is the differentiation, variation will be there by that part of recombination. Now this time, another term that is the genetics. What is the genetics? Genetic is the branch of biology or branch of science where we have studied about the heredity and the variation. Yani, jaha par aap heredity and another part that is the variation. Where we have studied about the heredity and variation, that term is known as the genetics. Means a simple thing is there. Some traits with are similar with parents, but some are different from parents. Different means there is a variation. And transfer from one generation to another generation, that is a heredity. When we have studied about that part, heredity as well as variation, then that branch is known as the genetics. In case of genetics, the father of genetics, that is the Gregor Johann Mendel. Mendel is the first scientist that how to explain heredity as well as variation also. That's why that is the father of genetics. So definitely, in case of that part, we have discussed some concepts which is related to the genetics. So first of all, what that concepts are there, then we have just these definitions also. First of all, in case of that part, the process by which characters are transferred from one generation to next generation. That is the inheritance as well as that is the heredity. So definitely you have just go through that part of heredity. Itna hi yad rakhna hoga heredity mein. The traits which can be transferred from one generation to another generation. Character ka ek generation se dusre generation mein transfer hone ka jo process hai. Wo inheritance hai. That is the inheritance as well as that is also known as the heredity. The characters which can be transferred from one generation to another generation, that is the inheritance as well as heredity. Correct? Second part. Another term is here. That is the variation. I have already discussed with you. What is the variation? We are different from parents. Not the, all the characters, particular the some characters are different. The, the difference with parents, the variation, the difference of in traits of individual, of a progeny, of a new birth, birth, there is the progeny is different from parents or that is known as the variation. Yani, aap khud apne khud ko not kare, khud pe isko apply kare. We are not similar with parents. Not 100% similar with parents. Maybe height is there. Maybe color of body is there. Maybe color of eye is there. Maybe color of hairs is there. Or the other number of traits. Some are similar with father. Some are similar with mother. But some are different from father and mother both. Then the variation or the different traits. That is the part of variation. The genetic part which is different from parents, that is the variation. Next, I have another term is there, that is the genetics. What is the genetics? Then your answer, branch of science which deals with inheritance, heredity as well as variation. We have discussed with two terms. One is the inheritance as well as heredity and second is the variation. That science is known as the genetics. That is known as the genetics. Two terms will be there, heredity as well as variation. 
the father of genetics i have already discussed with you the father of genetics that is the gregor johann mendel g j mendel the mendel have born in 1822 in austria 22 july 20 1822 in austria that is the gregor johann mendel that is the father of genetics father of genetics that is the gregor johann mendel mendel performed his experiments on the garden pea plant and the scientific name is the pisum sativum what term is here garden pea plant there is the pisum sativum the particular term is here there is the pisum sativum mendel performed his experiments with garden pea plant there is the pisum sativum and really he is conducted number of experiment total traits that is the more than 34 traits are there but experiment is maximum conducted only seven pair of traits what is a trait trait is the character all type of characters are present in the form of pair and which is known as the alleles the term of alleles means the traits as well as genes as well as the particular term of factor which will be given by the mendel there is the that pairs is known as the alleles they have the two forms one is the dominant form another is the recessive form those traits which can be appeared in f1 generation that is the dominant traits those traits which cannot be appear in f1 generation in f2 generation that is the recessive traits and recessive traits are always present in homozygous condition the traits which can be consist with same type of genes that is the homozygous and traits can be consist with dominant and recessive part that is the heterozygous so what the term is there they have the conduct experiment on pisum sativum he is conducted artificial pollination means the cell pollination is change with the part of cross pollination and by the artificial pollination also by the emasculation method experiment using the number of two breeding varieties having the contracting tract means we have conduct the cross between the different traits second he observed one trait at a time the very seven traits are there more than seven traits are there but that helps us conduct the experiment at a time there is only one trait that may be height that may be shape of seed that may be color of flower or that may be color of fruit or the seed that may be the shape of seed also so whatever type of trait will be there but out of all these traits that have conduct the experiment only one trait will be there next the hybrids hybrids means dominant and recessive cross is there the new progeny that is the hybrid plant with alternate form of single trait when we have conduct the trait cross between the one pair of trait for example only we have conduct with height then that is known as the mono hybrid cross mono hybrid cross means what a cross can be conducted between the one pair of trait for example height of plant height of plant there is the number of character is one but they have the two forms one is the dominant form another is the recessive form then what happen dominant is the tall and dwarf or the short that is the recessive when we have conduct the height of plant trait is there there is the mono hybrid dominant or recessive ke bich mein cross karwa do it's okay but character kitna only one there is a height of plant jab aap cross ek trait ke bich mein karwa rahe ho then there is the mono hybrid cross when we have conduct the cross between the two traits then that is the dihybrid cross for example height of plant and color of flower 
तो कितने ट्रेड्स हो गए टू हाइट ऑफ प्लांट कलर ऑफ फ्लॉवर टू ट्रेड्स आर देयर व्हेन द टू ट्रेड्स इट मींस डाई हाइब्रिड क्रॉस वन ट्रेड दैट इज द मोनो हाइब्रिड क्रॉस थ्री ट्रेड्स इट मींस ट्राई हाइब्रिड क्रॉस जितने ट्रेड्स लेकर के आप क्रॉस करवाते हो वो आपके पास में नाम जाना जाएगा एक ही ट्रेड ले रहे हो वन पेयर ऑफ ट्रेड मोनो हाइब्रिड टू पेयर ऑफ ट्रेड्स डाई हाइब्रिड थ्री पेयर ऑफ ट्रेड्स ट्राई हाइब्रिड so first he hybridized the plant with mono hybrid cross f1 generation f1 is again cross with f1 then there is the f2 generation f1 ka cross f1 ke sath yahan pe for example height mein humne tall cross with short or the doll capital t capital t cross with small t small t ya ye plant hai aapke paas mein ये हाइट में और ये दूसरा प्लांट है वो शॉर्ट है इनके बीच में क्रॉस करवाया ये आपके पास में पेरेंट वन और ये पेरेंट टू और जैसे ही क्रॉस करवाया नया प्लांट बना और जो नया प्लांट बना है वो नया प्लांट इस टाइप से बन जाए यानी इसमें दोनों ट्रेड रहेंगे तो ये आपके पास में एफ वन जनरेशन है कौन सी जनरेशन हुई एफ और एफ का वापस एफ के साथ क्रॉस कराओगे तो ये आपके पास में हो जाएगा एफ जनरेशन कौन सी जनरेशन एफ टू जनरेशन तो अब आपसे ये कह रहा है कि वन ट्रेड लोगे तो मोनो हाइब्रिड यहां ट्रेड एक ही है हाइट ऑफ प्लांट तो ये अपने पास में पूरा का पूरा कौन सा क्रॉस हो बोलो मोनो हाइब्रिड क्रॉस व्हाट टाइप ऑफ क्रॉस इज देयर मोनो हाइब्रिड क्रॉस वन पेयर ऑफ ट्रेड्स दैट इज मोनो हाइब्रिड यहां पर अगर टू ट्रेड पेयर ऑफ ट्रेड्स ले लेते तो ये आपके पास में क्या हो जाता डाई हाइब्रिड क्रॉस कैसे देखो जैसे एक आपने ले लिया हाइट ऑफ प्लांट और एंड कर एंड सेकेंड आपने ले लिया कलर ऑफ फ्लावर कलर ऑफ फ्लावर कितने ट्रेड्स हो गए टू वेन वी कंडक्ट द क्रॉस बिटवीन द टू पेयर ऑफ ट्रेड्स जैसे फॉर एग्जांपल कैप्टर टी कैप्टर टी कैप्टर आर कैप्टर आर क्रॉस विथ स्मॉल टी स्मॉल टी स्मॉल आर स्मॉल आर How much trades are there? Two trades. When the two trades are there, it means there is a dihybrid cross. One pair of trades, that is the one hybrid cross. Three trades are there, that is the trihybrid cross. So first, Python set I one. At a time, one trade is there, one hybrid cross, dihybrid cross, trihybrid cross, and second thing, that is the one more term is there. In case of the next part. In case of that part, Mandel how just conduct the experiments. Mandel the conduct the experiments on the particular part which the part is the just go to that part first of all. Mandel selected garden pea plant is experimental material because of following region. A question tha why the Mandel select pea plant only for his experiments. मेंडल्स अपने एक्सपेरिमेंट्स के लिए ओनली और ओनली पी प्लांट को ही क्यों सेलेक्ट कर रहे हैं देन सम रीजंस आर देयर फर्स्ट जस्ट यू हैव गो थ्रू द पर्टिकुलर पॉइंट्स पी प्लांट इज एनुअल दे हैव द सेकंड दे हैव द शॉर्ट लाइफ साइकिल फर्स्ट द प्लांट इज एनुअल सेकेंड शॉर्ट लाइफ साइकिल यानी थ्री टू फोर मंथ दे हैव कंप्लीट देयर लाइफ वन ईयर में तो थ्री से फोर थ्री जनरेशन आप उसकी ले सकते हो तो फर्स्ट द प्लांट इज एनुअल सेकेंड शॉर्ट लाइफ सेकेंड शॉर्ट लाइफ एंड थर्ड फर्स्ट एनुअल प्लांट सेकेंड शॉर्ट लाइफ साइकिल and third the flower is bisexual or the plant is bisexual means the plant have contain the male as well as female also plant mein male part bhi hai aur plant mein female part male and female both are there that's why that is known as the bisexual to so first annual second short life cycle third bisexual flower and fourth the really self pollinating water fourth is the self pollinating first annual plant 
सेकेंड शॉर्ट लाइफ साइकिल थर्ड बाई सेक्सुअल फोर्थ इज द सेल्फ पॉलिनेटिंग बट इफ यू वॉन्ट देन यू हैव कंडक्ट द क्रॉस पॉलिनेशन ऑल्सो आर्टिफिशियल पॉलिनेशन ऑल्सो नेक्स्ट द अनदर टर्म इज देयर देर इज अ क्रॉस पॉलिनेशन यानी मीन्स फर्स्ट एनुअल सेकेंड शॉर्ट लाइफ थर्ड बाई सेक्सुअल फोर्थ self pollinating if you want then you have conduct the cross pollination by the artificial process by the artificial process also and they have just produced a large number of seed at a one generation large number of seeds at a one generation ek hi generation mein large number of seed produce karta pea plants could easily be raised maintain and handle inke liye maintain karna aur handle karna koi zyada mehanga nahi hai easy process easy to handle as well as maintain the plants easy to maintain and handle of these plants and lastly the contrasting characters and traits were available large number of character without any using of device we can see all the character by the naked eyes for example height of plant color of flower size of seed size of fruit size color of fruit all these things are visible under the naked eyes so first all these characters are available in easy way and secondly there is the particular part that is the first easy to visibility of characters second number of seeds are generated at one generation easy to handle and maintaining process and easy to conduct of cross pollination self pollination is there as well as one more thing self pollinating process is there and annual plant short life cycle all these characters are responsible for the selection of the pea plant in case of that pea plant pea plant mendels have select the number of trees or especially that is given in your textbook also mendels have contained the total seven pair of trees or one question should be there how they conduct the experiment which is the dominant form and which is the recessive form so definitely you have to go through that table which is the dominant and which is the recessive how we can conduct the cross also so first thing seed or total ya aapko yaad rakhne ke liye first height of plant position of flower color of flower and shape of seed color of seed shape of fruit or the color of fruit so first number 1 seed se rounded is the dominant isko represent karoge aapke paas mein capital r capital r se wrinkled ko aap small r small r that is the recessive trait i have already discussed with you whatever type of trait is there the traits contain the two forms har type ke trait mein two forms honge ek dominant aur ek recessive har form डोमिनेट भी पेयर में रहेगा रिसेसिव भी पेयर में रहेगा शेप ऑफ सी राउंडेड एंड रिंग कलर सीड कलर येलो कैपिटल वाई कैपिटल वाई स्मॉल वाई स्मॉल वाई देर इज अ ग्रीन कलर क्लियर नेक्स्ट फ्लावर कलर वॉयलेट वी कैन यूज द कैपिटल डब्ल्यू और कैपिटल डब्ल्यू और द वाइट स्मॉल डब्ल्यू स्मॉल डब्ल्यू पोर्ड से पोर्ड मीन्स जो फली होती है फ्रूट कह सकते हो फुल फुल के लिए आपके पास में पर्टिकुलर टर्म जो भी सिंबल में आपको यूज करे या सिंबल आपको दे रखा हो और कंस्ट्रिक्टेड झूलीदार पोर्ड कलर ग्रीन कैपिटल जी कैपिटल जी येलो स्मॉल जी स्मॉल जी डोंट राइट कैपिटल वाई जो आपने डोमिनेट में सिंबल यूज किया है उसी का स्मॉल लेटर ही यूज करना है फ्लावर पोजिशन एक्सियल कैपिटल ए कैपिटल ए टर्मिनल स्मॉल ए स्मॉल ए 
axial is dominant and terminal is recessive green is dominant yellow is recessive for the pore color and lastly stem height tall capital t capital t lower all the sort small t small t so mandel have conduct the experiment on the total is seven pair of traits first height of plant position of flower color of flower shape of pod shape of seed sorry color of pod shape of seed color of seed so total is seven traits which will be conducted by the mandelism in that experiments and one part is the dominant and another part is the recessive so how that can conduct the mono hybrid cross then you have just go through that part first of all in case of that part the house is conduct the mono hybrid cross such as in that part first parents a plant there is a tall or definitely you have just go through that part also as a hybrid bana sakte ho short iske liye apne capital t capital t use kiya dwarf ke liye apne plant ko slab se bana diya और स्मॉल टी स्मॉल टी यूज किया गैमेटोजेनेसिस वर्क गैमेट्स मींस गैमेटोजेनेसिस फॉर्मेशन ऑफ गैमेट्स इन चैप्टर नंबर 3 वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड गैमेट्स बने आइसोलेट वर्क कैपिटल टी और स्मॉल टी ये होमोजाइगस एंड ये भी होमोजाइगस कैपिटल टी और स्मॉल टी गैमेट्स का फ्यूचर हो फर्टिलाइजेशन हुआ कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी हाइब्रिड बन गया एफ1 जनरेशन है अब ये कह रहा है ऑन सेल्फिंग यानी एफ वन जनरेशन का क्रॉस किसके साथ करवाओगे एफ वन जनरेशन के साथ कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी क्रॉस विद कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी एफ वन जनरेशन इज क्रॉस विद एफ वन जनरेशन बाय द गैमेटोजेनेसिस प्रोसेस वी हैव द टू पार्ट कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी लेटर ऑन अगेन द फर्टिलाइजर्स प्रोसेस इज देयर वन पार्ट इज द मेल अनदर पार्ट दैट इज जस्ट एज कंडक्टर इज फीमेल और देयर इज द पोनेट स्क्वायर स्क्वायर पार्ट कंडक्टेड यहां पर आपके पास में सी को टेबलेट फॉर्म में यू भी ले सकते हो आप लोग दैट पार्ट में भी लिया अब आप एक काम करो यहां पर इसके गैमेट्स बने कैपिटल टी इसका बन दूसरा हो गया स्मॉल टी इसका गैमेट्स बना कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी इस गैमेट को इसके साथ फ्यूज करो कैपिटल टी कैपिटल टी बना इस गैमेट को इसके साथ कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी इस गैमेट्स को इसके साथ फ्यूज करो कैपिटल टी स्मॉल टी इसको इसके साथ स्मॉल टी स्मॉल टी सो नाउ इस टाइम दैट इज द विच टाइप ऑफ जनरेशन इज देयर एफ टू जनरेशन एफ वन जनरेशन का क्रॉस करवाया एफ वन के साथ करवाया और विच जनरेशन इज देयर दैट इज द एफ टू जनरेशन इन केस ऑफ एफ टू जनरेशन देर हैव द टू फोन्स आर देयर वन इज द फिनोटिपिकल रेशियो एंड दिस इज द जीनोटिपिकल रेशियो फिनो का मतलब होता है एक्सटर्नल अपीरेंस एक्सटर्नल appearance in case of external appearance how to external form is there visibility external visibility for example in these plants there is a height there is again height there is again in height but there is a sort in height it means what thing is there on the basis of visibility three plants out of four plants three are the tall dikhne mein teen bade or one is the sort so the phenotypical ratio of f1 generation sorry f2 generation mono hybrid cross there is a three ratio one tall with dog three ratio one teen dikhne mein bade hain aur ek dikhne mein chhota dikhne ke basis pe hota hai phenotypical aur genotypical means on the basis of genetical organization just you have check it capital t capital t Capital T small T small T small T. You can count it. Capital T capital T only one. Capital T small T one. Sorry, not two. One and two. Two small T small T one. Then what is that ratio? One ratio two ratio one. So there is the genotypical ratio one ratio two ratio one. Genotypical means on the basis of gene organization. Phenotypical means on the basis of external appearance. so today we have discussed only that part remaining part we will discuss on tomorrow